Вот маленький дятел размером с кардинальчика. Кардинал той больше. Hello, my dearest teachers. Welcome to my channel. This is Julia, and today I would like to show you two of my work and project, work in the progress projects, and one more. I decided to start today with a little bit of changes. So. Um, for this week, I finished uh, totally this side. Um, I was working on this side, on the branches of the tree, I assume it's behind. I uh, finished her hat. I really love that hat. It's, it reminds me of uh, some kind of Hogwarts, Harry Potter Hogwarts hat. Uh, a little bit was left um, over here. So I, literally I finished the whole area over here and now I moved my hoop down on the left side or right side. Uh, right now here I left a little bit of the background and I will be able to move my hoop over here. So it will be um, the last piece I will have to finish. Um, there are still lots of lots of uh, things to stitch, lots of details. So I uh, hope maybe by Halloween she will be ready. She is really, really beautiful. Um, uh, who curious where did I got pattern? Uh, this is a Dread Geeks company. They have really nice. Mm, very nice uh, done small patterns as you can see so you can find it on thread gigs also I was continue working on that beautiful owl and I assume maybe in a week or so it will be already done and I I will be able to start my second owl, the white owl, which we're gonna open that kit together sometime later after this beauty will be done. Uh, the pattern is very easy to follow. Uh, the floss is very wonderful, very soft. And if you scare to work on even wave, I will tell you don't be. It's really, really easy. That's my second project on even wave, and I really love it. It's really easy to follow, really, really easy to stitch, and I don't know some kind of beauty by using even wave, I think. So this is my owl um, by Lanarte, and also I'm going to start this kit today. Uh, this is RTO company. It's called Pink Bliss. I believe it's on a 14 count canvas, 14 count Aida. Uh, but I don't like uh, the way the background will be not stitched, as you can see. I don't want 14 count with big holes and it will be very visible. So I decided to switch it on such a beautiful blueberry pie color 22nd count Zwigert. Um this piece I bought a while ago I believe I bought it on Etsy and um, I think it was like two, two three years ago I bought it and I hide it away because it was super tiny um, and I thought like, oh my gosh, I don't know how to stitch in it. And it's such a beautiful fabric. I'm probably gonna put it away till better days. Maybe one time, one day I will find what I'm gonna stitch in it. 
And here we go. This day finally come. I think these roses will be uh, going to look very beautiful on that type of the canvas. I'm sorry, it's on the dark, <laughs> on the shade. It's much brighter actually. <clears throat> and uh, on these roses, as you can see, a little bit of blue on the background, but it's halfway stitch, um, half stitched stitches. So I think it's going to be uh, anyway look wonderful on that um, that type of fabric. That's how pattern looks like. I will show you a little part of it. As you can see, it's very easy to follow, very easy to stitch. There's um, two sheets of canvas uh, pattern goes in there. A little more over there. A John James needle, but the needle is really, really big, so <laughs> I definitely gonna use different one. And of course, this beautiful floss. This is DMC. Here goes two organizers. Unfortunately, it's stamped, so I will show you from other side. I love all these colors. It's like something you will not tired of the project because the colors are different, not the same shades, and it will be fun to follow and stitch it. Look, such a pretty colors. Oh my gosh. So beautiful. So beautiful. Well, <clears throat> for now, that's all my ideas and projects. I, of course, don't put away my other projects. Once in a while, I'm gonna work on it. I'm gonna rotate them in between so I don't get tired of anything. Um, and uh, thank you for watching me and staying with me. Please click like and subscribe if you like um, what I'm stitching and what I'm doing. And please leave me a comment. I will be always happy to read it and answer to you. Thank you. Bye-bye. Опять пришел пророк на ужин. Ha <laughs> <laughs>